Hey guys, my name is Sam Knight, and welcome back to my. Hello. Welcome back to Minecraft. I got uh, I'm alone. My Kayla's at work, so there'll be much more energy. Hello. Huh. huh. I could use some cactus. Um. Huh? Yeah. Okay. So. This episode is going to be all about building some farms. All about those farms. Please stop yelling in my ear, please. Okay, so, farms, 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 farms. I am going to make farms and shit, you guys probably won't have hardly anything to do with the farm making process, like at all. Because... It's very boring and very tedious, and it'll take me about, like, 40 minutes, and truth be told, hardly any of it's going to be usable, because just nothing happens. So, uh, I'll just bring you along, probably update you after every farm is done, and then we'll just go on some type of adventure from there, so this video has some actual character to it. Come in here, come in here, Mr. Sir. Excuse you hear you hear this guy bitching at me? Okay, I don't need that many. Okay, I need that should be good. Okay. Oh, it's getting dark. I'm gonna have to be careful. I need torches as well. Son of oh, I need a lot of torches, man. Shit. How many torches do I have? I don't think I have any. Yeah, no, I ain't got none. Oh, I got a lot of coal, though. Okay, cool. That ain't gonna be nearly enough. What was that noise? That still ain't gonna be nearly enough, but it's a start. Okay. Here we go. See, what I do is... After I go 12 to 15, just depending on if there's water around, I go over to the side. I don't know if I've ever done this before on the channel or not, but I need these to get up and going for food purposes. Uh, now this, you go over five blocks. Say so one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so this is the width of room one. See, one, two, three, four, five. Cool. We'll go for one block, but this is the, right now, this is the least important farm. It's the tree farm. Tree farm goes first. But because it's tree farm, you also have to dig straight up as high as you can in every direction. Or in every block. This is the only one that I have to do this for. This is the one I'm actually going to build last. But because it's the way it is... It needs to go first. Don't worry. I have this. I have my handy dandy notebook. So it'll be okay. I'm uh I'm gonna make this and then storage. I'll probably actually make the storage unit first so I can bring everything down here. Because my food chest is just a mess and then once this is up and running I can actually, you know, go around, have fun, do adventures, things like that. Like, because it's basically been uh, desperately trying not to starve simulator. See, now this is my storage. It goes back many block. Actually, what I'm going to do is get the amount of wood that I need. And that amount is written down right here. And it says that I need... 48 wood. Okay. I have all that into that. Uh, we're going to need one crafting table for now, but m many more to come in a minute. Um, first crafting table. I think it goes on the... Either that... No, it doesn't go on the end. That would be stupid. But... Uh, the, the crafting benches that I use are mainly for just decoration to kind of fill the empty space. All this 
Oh, excuse me. All this gets filled in with, uh... Oh, this is the next farm, by the way. The next farm is wheat, and it starts in here. And I just carve it out a little bit. Throw a torch on. This is the tree farm. goes back ten blocks. You'll see it at the end. Uh, we're gonna need this, so I can whip up how many? I do believe it's ten double chests, which totals up to twenty uh, chest chests. Yeah, twenty single chests. So, let's find those boys. Yeah. Boom. 20 single chest. And these are all for like a whole bunch of different shit. Um I do believe those two are cocoa bean and nether wart. Like everything that you can farm gets farmed down here. And right now, I'm not really worried about organizing it. I'm more worried... Oh, and then a torch goes over every workbench. And now my farm storage is done. And I do put the item frames over it to differentiate what goes where. But right now, I don't have that type of luxury. So, it's fine. I have to make some buckets here in a second. Now, these don't go back 10. These go back 8. So you end up getting a full stack of everything. So then this is where the water goes. I'm going to have a lot of replacing this shit with stone at the end of it. Now, I do split some of the farms. See, now this is the next farm going into here. Now, I haven't actually made a farm yet. Don't worry. It's fine. There's a method to this, I promise. <laughs> Look, this is the the width of it. Now this goes back. This is it goes seven more blocks. Okay, there's the general shape of my farms. Don't worry, all this will be stone and very uniform in a minute. I have to actually go up here and get some um, dirt. It's time for dirt to start. Also, I did start. Yes, I, yeah, I'm aware you're still here. Takes a, oh, I can bring down all this shit, too. Oh, it it's not nearly as messy as I thought it once was. Okay, that's fine. This looks better already. It's, it's, it's not meant to look flashy. I know that there are flashy farms out there, and I envy those. But at the same time, I don't envy those, because like that's a lot of extra time and effort. This just is sort of like, okay, I need to grow food. Let's grow some food. It's up to you how you want to do your own farms. But me, I like it like this. Not too complicated, not too simple. I've been thinking about upgrading them permanently with like redstone, but I'm not exactly sure how I would do that yet. I've been I've been doing a lot of thinking, but not a lot of action. I should probably go on creative and do some of that stuff, just to see what I can like throw together. All right, everything to see this all gets replaced with dirt. This doesn't though. So just just catching up real quick, and then I'll bring you guys back when. More farms have been finished. Okay. So this farm is completely done. Wheat, completely done. We'll see these two. They'll get fertile here in a minute. Um, and then these go in the, all the way in the back with tree saplings. So they boom. Actually, no. It's usually the other way around. I'm very picky when it comes to certain things that I don't need to be. And then this is sugar cane... Something else than potato, carrot, pumpkins, melons, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pumpkins, melons, beetroot. Uh, beetroot's back there with sugarcane. It's okay. Everything's fine. <laughs> okay, so, wheat is done. Now on to sugarcane, which is a slightly different farm. So now what I've got to do is I've got to get dirt because I ran out of dirt. But good thing I actually have to do a lot of leveling so I'm just gonna use the dirt that or I'm just gonna start leveling a little bit until I have like two two and a half stacks of dirt granted it's not a lot of the leveling I need to do but it's some of it see everything that, everything that I have works together you know what I mean well, it's like I need a lot of leveling but I can use a lot of the dirt for the farms. I know there's a lot of digging for the farms, but I can use all that cobblestone
for literally all of the tools throughout the rest of the series or, or rest of the uh, rest of the run through it's not like it's a waste of nothing is a waste is what I'm trying to say here hang on I don't need this shit okay so now this is my jungle uh, my uh, cocoa bean one I just line this whole thing three blocks tall along the walls with jungle wood and throw the cocoa beans on it and then see this is where that goes and this I have to leave a space in between the torches so the cocoa beans can actually grow and now it's nether wart and then I'm done with building my farms and then I think the rest of this video will be me attempting uh, to fill the rest of these farms because that would be kind of a fun concept right there just why not making the farms happen might as well cram it all into one video so then episodes three on can actually be entertaining because this one I'm gonna shoot you straight I the only times I've been having any type of fun is when I'm talking because I'm talking to you guys and which means I know I can include it I absolutely adore Minecraft except this part this is the this is this is why I didn't want to reboot a Minecraft series this reason here but now that I'm almost done and I'm in the last little bit here it's just, I just dig out a 5x5 five five thing and then I fill it with soul sand and then I just call it there man look <laughs> this has been hell I hated this it has been that was too many blocks down um, it's been an hour since I started recording and I am I don't like doing this I don't like making the farms I dislike making farms in Minecraft Michaela loves it but she hates the way I do it for some reason so, I don't know. I don't know why she hates it. But I've, I've chopped this up to a bearable amount. So you guys tell me, do you like my farm setup? Or do you think there's something I could change? Because, see, I like it. I like having it underground for several reasons. One, trampling isn't a thing. And two, they're completely out of the way. They don't take up any space. Because they're underground. They take up zero space. One, two, three, two blocks backwards. Yeah, I just like it that they're out of the way. You can't. Come on, man. You can't trip up over them. Like, they're not in the well. I gotta move my farms or something. No, no, no. They're underground. They're not going anywhere. They don't need to go anywhere. They're out of the way entirely that and if um, I were to, now Dimitri I was talking to Dimitri about how to fight the wither and he said take it to uh, take it as high up in the nether as you can up to bedrock because you know how the whole nether is encased in bedrock um, he said take it up to bedrock in the nether and that way you can kind of stay with him and at the same time he won't really destroy anything Okay, fill that with soul sand, nether wart, jungle, I need melons, I need, I need basically everything. Uh, now the only thing I have left to cut out is the tree farm, which goes back 10 blocks. Okay, it's done. All of the farms are done. All that needs, all it needs is like tending and planting. They're all like shaped up the way they need to be. Now, oak and, um, oak and birch, I think are the only two saplings that can grow like this. Let's see, yeah, there's that, and then these are just about done, and this is going to be potato, beetroot, all of this is carrot, that's pumpkin, this will be melon, this will be jungle wood, this will be nether wart, that's everything. As of right now, unless they add something else you can farm. I know you can do stuff, some stuff with um, mushrooms, but you literally just plant them under a tree, I believe. Oh, I'm getting hungry again. Okay, um... 
All right, so now I'm going to do a little bit of digging on the interweb and find out exactly where to go to find everything I need to finish my farms. So I'm going to cut to that, I guess. I'm going to go out on an adventure, see if we can fill up them farms. Okay, so, whoa. Okay, so, what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna head north, and I'm gonna see what I can find. <gasps> oh, yeah! Oh, shit, it's getting dark. Okay, um. Oh, shit, I didn't bring food. Okay, this is turning into a disaster. Um, it's fine, though. It's fine. I'm going to need a lot of these for my defenses. I'm going to need... Oh, I didn't bring a shovel, either. No shovel, no food. Nothing. Damn it. Okay, well, I didn't really want to do my wall in this one. So I guess that's good. Um... <laughs> I mean, I could start my defenses with these, but should I, when I could just get them all while I'm here? No. Man, I just realized, like, just now, how little, uh, like, threats I've actually met in this episode. Like, I have not, this is my first monster. Them guys be dicks. Like, I wasn't sprinting, I wasn't jumping, or nothing before, so I barely had to deal with hunger, and now I'm like... Shit, I didn't bring food! Now, I like to think that these mean there's a village nearby, but I know that's not true. So... Maybe there's a village nearby. Okay, let's... Hee <laughs> hee! Holy shit, there's sandstone here. I need this for my wall. Why do I never do this? This is brilliant. I could get a lot of sandstone out of this. I'm going to get a couple stacks of sandstone out of this, and I'm going to build part of my wall this episode. Maybe the whole damn thing, because this ain't too far from home. Damn, I'm good. Okay. Whee! That hurt. Yee! Okay. That's fine. Let's see. Oh, protection was at three? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Getting some stuff, getting some things. Last one. Okay, this was kind of a shitty temple. But it did. Oh, I got a saddle. Okay, it's all worth it now. Cut sandstone? I don't like cut sandstone, I like normal sandstone. So I'm going to use this cut sandstone to get here. Okay, that's bad. I just saw those red berry thingies. I like those. This is a trench. Okay. These. Sweet berries or something? Yeah. No. Damn it. Man, me and Michaela, uh, have had, like, shit, I'd probably say 800 of those every time we play. Ow, ow, ow. This is a problem. This is, like, discount food, but it's food. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah. Oh my! In between.
between. Oh yeah, that was expertly done. I'm trying really, 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 really hard not to. Um. Oh shit, that's a skeleton. Those are the worst. Those are the worst. I'm trying really, 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 really hard not to die here. I'd really like to get these sweet berries home. Ow. Just plant them around my house as like a mini perimeter for right now. Also, their food. And food is good. The more sources of food you can have, the better. And right now, when I don't have two thirds of the things you can farm, now's a good time to have sweet berries. My nose itches. My nose itches. My nose itches. My nose itches. Thank you for being a part of that with me. Stop. Stop. That was close. This is so much better, man. I've been wanting to do that for so long. And then it goes up three blocks all the way around. Now back here, you go back 30 blocks so you can fit the animal farms and also not have to hear them scream. So give me one second. Nice. Man, there ain't much flattening to do at all. And then I gotta go a couple blocks out to, uh, for my defenses. But this, I've had to flatten way worse before. And I mean, like, way worse. Like, it took me hours. So I'm, I'm I can't do the jump run. That's, that's a habit I need to get out of. <laughs> I'm already off the map, and I'm right next to my house. Look at that. Wait, where, where, where is on the map? Right here. Over there is not, though. The lava is not on the map, I don't think. Oh, this is tragic. Do I have a diamond pickaxe yet? Oh, okay. Um, okay. Okay, so... <laughs> I think I've got the whole first layer of my wall done, which is great and fine and dandy, but I also think... Yeah, there's a spider jockey outside, and I could have sworn those are supposed to be rare. Okay, here we go. Mmm! Killed it. Oh, Lord. Okay, bad, 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 bad. Oh, oh my God, I cannot believe it's letting me sleep. Why does it shoot me outside? Why does that happen? And how can I make it stop? That's information I would kill for. There's an Enderman here. Okay, I have extra sandstone. Just gonna go ahead and. No! Wrong! Damn it! I need to put it back here so I can start luring animals back home with me. See, now here's what happens is you. One, two, three, four, five. See, that's where the fence goes. So, here. This is where you want it. This is where I want it. Probably won't be able to get all... Might not be able to get even just the two levels of it done. One, two, three, four, five. That's where that goes. You want it two forward right there. Yep, same as over there. Now I probably could set start setting it up with this, but it has to go one block taller. And then I put another fence on the top of it. Um just for extra uh, well not support, but extra no stay out ness. Um I think I think we're finally coming to a spot in the episode where we can end it. Um, it's been a long episode. 
Um, I don't need this water. I don't want this water. Is there water nearby? Yes, there is. Goodbye, water. I never needed you. Except when I did. Then I needed you. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to plop that down and plop that down. Because I only have... The leveling that I have to do outside of my wall only comes out... See, uh, fire goes here, lava moat goes here, magma block goes here, cactus goes here, and then I leave one extra. Or two. So it's got to like be leveled out to about here. All the way around. And that's not... That's ten minutes, maybe twenty. So it's super easy and mega worth it in the long run. Hell, even in the short run, it's worth it. Um, now I'll just throw this shit in here if I'm not going to use it. It feels really, really good to have all this stuff done. Like, really good. And be sure to check in for the next one, because we're making some serious progress, and I want to see you there.